Alright guys, what is up? It is Brand Dubstep here today. Today it is about 2 something, I think it's like 2.46. And today I'm kind of I'm going to be doing something really cool. So as you can see in front of the kit right now, you can see two bikes. We have a kid's bike, practically brand new, in great shape, all set to go. And I have this old style 80s BMX bike. Now, right now, it's gonna, I'm going to be rebuilding it. I got to repaint it and everything. It needs a whole new paint job on it. As you can see, there's rust coming off. This was a chrome bike that I got to rebuild it. So I'm going to be taking the tires off of it. So I said to myself, I wanna, I'm going to go on town to the skate park with Hunter this weekend on Monday. Or uh, Sunday we're hanging out on Monday. Monday we're going to the skate park. But anyway. Um, and I want to use the tires still because I'm going to be rebuilding this. And the tires aren't going to be doing anything. So I said to myself, I wonder if there's any way to take the tires from this bike and put it on the kid bike that has pedal brakes and everything. So we're going to see that. I'm going to show you guys how I rebuild my bikes and everything. And shit like that. Um... Now, this tire is kind of wobbly and makes noise, so that's why this, this front tire is going on the front of this bike, because this one's in better condition. So these two tires right here will be going on. This bike is going to be in the backyard, I'm going to rebuild it, paint and everything, and get that done with. But right now, we're going to go ahead and rebuild this bike with really nice tires. And a new seat, because this seat's pretty uncomfortable. So I hope you guys enjoy the video, this will be in fast mode as soon as I start working, when the video starts. So I hope you guys enjoy, I'll put it as a medium speed fast so you guys can see it. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, so here we go. Alright guys, so here we go. Alright guys, so after you've done and taken the tire off, make sure you always put your chain back on because if you don't, your chain could get tangled up and you don't want that. So, just put it back on the bike like that, strap to the back of the, where the tire would go, and then just move it off. I usually duct tape my, I usually duct tape it so it stays on there so it doesn't go anywhere. So, alright, so now that I've gotten the tires off, they're all set to go. I got the front and back and the tags now. We're good to go now. So, the next thing I gotta do is I gotta pull over the Red bike and after I do these parts. Yeah, so I have a bike stand too, so it's a lot easier than having it like that. The only reason I did that is because it was a quick little thing to do. But right now, it runs, it rides, it's alright, it's not the best, so we're already build this thing and make it so much better. Alright, hope you guys enjoy. make sure they're all lined up like the little thing to hold the back brake, don't want to lose that. But I would have to go into the tire before you go
That way you don't lose your fart. Alright guys, so we, I ran into a slight problem. I didn't measure the angle of the uh, spokes, or where the tire fits in, and this is going to be too short to fit into the hole, so what we're going to do is just going to take the original front tire and put a slip back on, because I have no other tires that will fit this, but the back tire does fit, I just checked that, so that will fit right on the back of the bike. So we're going to have two different tires, I can't do much about that. So, yeah. Okay, back to our thing. Oops, the boo. Sorry. Okay.
I'll get back to you guys in a minute. Alright guys, so now I have gotten the seat. This is a mongoose seat. It's a little tear at the top, but that's alright. But it's going to be a lot comfier than the one that's on it now. So let's go ahead and we're going to go and start from the seat on the bike now. Alright guys, got the seat on, air the tires up, and this thing is all set to go. It is amazing how it made it look. This thing is neat. So now we've turned a kid's bike into a street cycle to ride around for drifts and tricks and other stuff. No more pedal brakes, just front brakes now, because that's all it's got for right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to see more of this kind of stuff, uh, comment below and subscribe, and I'll do more of this kind of stuff. I have other bikes right here that I'm working on. Right now I'm working on now, I'm putting gears on it. If you want to see more, then I'll upload this. I'll upload. I'll upload this video. But if you guys want to see more like this, of me rebuilding bikes, doing a different kind of shit to kid bikes, then I will uh, upload more videos. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll probably make a video when I get the years for that bike because it'll be coming in very soon. And I hope you guys enjoyed. So thank you for watching, and see you later. See you guys in the next video. Bye bye.